far as the chaos we find ourselves in these days, it's difficult to say which side pulled the trigger first. Uh, we did. Arugia deployed an automatic intercept system with drones. Osea implemented long-range attacks to bypass them. Still, Arugia decided to sabotage Osea's communications and navigation technology. Arugia couldn't launch a satellite themselves, but they were still able to hack the software of the Osean transmission and navigation systems. So Before they were smarter Osea than us. Noticed, half of their satellites were hijacked. That's when things got ugly. Oh, it already did. To knock out each other's capabilities. Both forces launched fighters loaded with anti-satellite missiles at the same time. Only military satellites were targeted. However, their destruction created a debris field in orbit, which wiped out scores of other satellites, both private and government-owned. What kept the world relatively sane up to that point had been free-flowing data and information. But now, those were gone. What's left? All that remained was chaos and confusion. True. Government true. And civilian broadcasts and transmissions were cut off. The flow of information had ceased. Forces on both sides of the conflict now found themselves unable to communicate with their superiors. Many of the smaller countries annexed by Arugia and yearning for their independence seized the opportunity and started their own uprisings. As for why some of Osea's military decided to break off from the main force and continue on their own, I have no idea. Perhaps there was some sort of dispute over the chain of command. The continent that had once seen wars that were only fought between Osea and Rugia was now full of numerous conflicts between rival leaders vying for power. Insurgencies were everywhere. I even heard a rumor that a group of Osean convicts had rebelled. Rumors. Oh, I thought that was a phone. <laughs> that even looked like a phone. Like this, something as trivial as a rumor could find its way here. Communications from corporate were cut off. Apparently, the entire computer network was down. Apparently. Was decision to make our drones autonomous with AI instead of being radio controlled, wise and forward thinking. Even with their GPS offline, they can still use their sensors to navigate as long as they're working properly. I'm sure the drones are still working perfectly, following their mission orders to the letter. So you I took out our satellites. New data to them. But without a connection, I can't upload the software to the active drones. The new ones we're making, though, there should still be enough time to upgrade those before they're activated. I'll be taking the data I've acquired away from the front lines now. Okay. And I'll be taking the girls too. I told my assistant Masa it was time to get Mihai's granddaughters ready to leave here. You're she's abandoning a ship here, huh? Girls, but she has a way about her. And I'm sure she won't have any trouble with it. Granddaughters are gonna leave. <laughs> I saw a plane flying off in the distance. I imagine it was looking for a safer place. The plane had a rose emblem on it. Rose emblem. It's, it's bringing back some memories there. I wonder which one though. Perusia's communication networks have been down since their satellites were destroyed. Unfortunately, we are experiencing trouble too. All of Yuzia has been affected, and we don't know when things will be back up and running. We're not even sure if this is Arugia's doing. Still, we will follow the strategy that was originally planned, and move on to the next operation after liberating Parbanti. Let's get to it. Since the war began, we've been receiving communications in secret from an officer in the Arugian army. With the capital under our control, Arugia's radical element is losing support quickly, affecting the balance of power. What balance was there? HQ is thinking of using the military officer as a way to gain leverage to settle peace negotiations. The officer is currently hiding in the outskirts of Anchorhead Bay, having joined up with support dispatch from the Ocean Army. The plan is that they'll take a standard vehicle to a rendezvous point at a harbor in the east part of the city, where a helicopter will be waiting. 
I would like the new Strider Squadron to provide escort for the officer. Cyclops will remain at the base on standby to serve as defense. With the communication network currently down in the capital, I very much doubt Arusia will be able to mount a regimented counterattack. However, it is likely that Arusia's intelligence department and the remaining forces who are aware of the officer's movements will interfere. Keep a close eye on the officer and make sure he stays safe. Our victory in Farbanti has given us a golden opportunity to finally end this war. Be safe out there. Take note that our satellite-based IFF has become unreliable following recent communications failure. As such, target ID will be done by processing the images from the infrared cameras on your aircraft. Objects will initially appear as unknown on your HUDs, but will be ID'd once you close in on them for a set period of time. Dang. Okay, so it looks like our our radars are down. We have to rely on our own sensors on our plane now. It's going to take a little bit there. We'll see. All right. Let's see what happens next. I don't I don't know what we're going to be fighting again, so that's the problem. I don't know if I want to take the grounds or the missile the long range. Mm, I'll take the air to air for I guess I'll take the air to air. Take the air to air for now. Or, yeah, why not? I'll take air to air. We'll see what happens. If that's if that's a failure in that half, we'll see. Vision sixteen, last hope. I'm very close to finishing the game. Then I'm noticing. If it goes by any of the other Ace combats, it should be only miss. Should be only twenty missions in total. So. To the unidentified Ocean craft, this is Captain Carl of the Ocean Army. Are you here for the escort? You're not the squadron I was expecting. Are you really friendly? Over. This is Longcaster, airborne warning and control system for the Ocean Long Range Strategic Strike Group. Captain Carl, they're on our side. And those two pilots we've heard about must be here too. Okay, I hope you're right. Oh my God. Oh no. Well, let me process the unknowns caught in your camps to identify friend or foe. The process will be faster if you get a close up, well centered image. Meanwhile, you just run if they shoot us, right? Affirmative. Always identify your target before you fire. This is not going to be fun. <laughs> This is not going to be a fun mission. I already, I can tell already. This is not a fun mission already. Lawncaster, what's with you with sandwiches, man? I should have went ground. I should have went ground missiles. I really should have went ground missiles. Finishing. Nah, I, I, I'm pretty sure I won't. Probably have to be leave until tomorrow night. This will be my next time. I only have about like two hours left anyways. Oh shit. That was a bad idea. 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 That's a bad idea from the start there. <laughs> Longcaster, are all of these really unknowns? It's a state of civil war. The Erosian army is fighting itself. There's no guarantee the Oceans won't okay. shoot us. In I feel like I should be... I feel like I should actually show and get the radar working first before I, uh... Before I start destroying everything. The process will be faster if you get a close-up well-centered image. Meanwhile, just run if they shoot us, right? 
Minor note on this mission, holding your target button will lock the camera on the target and make it easier as long as you don't go down into the streets. Oh yeah, yeah, the inspect kind of you inspected, right? Oh yeah, it does make it faster. Well, if you're closer, obviously. Thanks for the tip. Man, Longcaster and your sandwiches, man. You're always hu you're always hungry. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a city guy. Ah, oh, fuck no. Alright, that's two times getting hit by the same. I think that was the same building. I feel like that was the same building. Longcaster, are all of these Damn. Really unknowns? It's a state of civil war. The Erosian army is fighting itself. There's no guarantee the Oceans won't shoot us in this confusion. Well, image process the unknowns caught in your camps to identify friend or foe. The process will be faster if you get a close-up, well-centered image. Meanwhile, you just run if they shoot us, right? Affirmative. Always identify your target before you fire. War is something I'll never get used to, but tonight has been a total shock. Yes, this night's whole shocking right now. I wonder if it's easier just to identify all of them first. It sounds like it. It feels like it is. Entering the Anchorhead Bay area. Buildings will block your line of sight. Make sure to keep track of your objective. How this war ends depends on this mission. I'm counting on you. Understood. Strata one. Fox two. It's in there's some Erosians. Now nah, just blow up everyone. No, no, of course not. Yay. I mean, there's ambushes? <laughs> that should be an ally. Yeah, that's the same. Pretty sure those are all gun things, right? Yeah, there you go. Okay. Okay. For sure, these helicopters aren't ours. Under oh no, that's a fighter jet. Really? Vehicle up ahead. Think it's gonna ask us to pay a toll? Get 
Yes. Ouch. Chaffed it. Too many, too many shots. Working on it. Ceasefire. I don't know, are you? I'm working on it. Another missile. Another missile. Okay, those are down. Yeah, don't go into the ocean, guys. All these unknowns, man. You gotta have the unknowns and the other missiles here. We'll record it, thank you. Force guiding them? Uh oh. The Belkins? So the, it was the princess error here. The city looks this. Why do we get the feeling this is not the end of it? There's something there's something gonna happen. Yeah, there you go. Allies, okay. Good. Kill off the APCs. Why do I feel like it's a ground? Yeah, it is. Get this guy off my back. 
We're working on it. The VIP is taking fire. His vehicle stopped. Strider three, box two. Strider one, break. Where is the fire coming from, tank? Try to help us before we get shot. It's not like this is a tank or anything. I know it's not a tank, but that's the problem here. Okay, we got everything. Damn you, tanks! Okay, that's allies. What about you guys? What are you guys? Where? Who are you guys? Oh, there's the there's the vehicles. Okay. Yeah, you guys are already getting ambushed. I need to kill you. I need to kill these guys first. Working on it. Why does this look like San Francisco, the San Francisco area, Bay Area at least? It almost looks like it is. It's under attack? Hang on, hang on, I'm coming. Missile. Missile. Man, this mission. Not sure if I'm liking it or not. Oh shit, I'm I am low on missiles. Oh crap. Oh shit, no, I shot an ally! Crap! I shot an ally! Whoops. When the lights go down in the city and the sun signs on the bay. <laughs> eh, maybe. Maybe so. <laughs> What what missile? What missile? Where is our guys left? Where is our guys? Who is who? Who is who? It's an erosion plane. Okay. I'm out of missiles. Uh, this is not going to be fun. Yeah, not surprised, I'll be honest. I'm working on it. Oh, I almost hit I almost hit that. 
Ouch. Sorry. Oh, thank you. Thank you, ground floor. Thank you for the mo thank you thank you, mod. Having issues here. I'm running. I'm out of missiles. Get these aircraft out of the way. Make sure who's who. There's some autonomous mode here. Did we make it? Yay! <laughs> I was running out of missiles. I ran out of missiles, I mean. And I failed. Fuck. I was not paying attention. <laughs> was totally not paying attention at all. That's fine. I just needed my extra missiles. I just need to reload it anyways. No problem. Thank you, checkpoints. All right, good. That's fine. Good thing, I'm, good thing there's checkpoints in the game. Uh, I got a little checkpoints. I freaking completed it, but I just failed that actually being paying attention. <laughs> I just needed to restock my weapons. What? That was only a hit? Oh, come on, tanker. I should be dead. There he is. Now he's dead. Right, these guys should be allies, right? From, yep. Yeah. Gotta love my new. Gotta love my new weapons. Alright, there you go. Got it. Alright, there were some er other erosions. Okay, what about these guys? Erosion. Ally. Enemy. Okay, don't crash. <laughs> don't crash this time. All right, good. <laughs> I'm, I'm taking my hands off the controller right now. Make sure. <laughs> All right. We're good. Fox 2. Fox 2. Yay! Is it the Soul Squadron again? Why do I get the feeling this is not real? <laughs> That's not right. Try to get a little closer. Weapon use is prohibited. This ain't until Dawn Pat, don't take your hands off the controller. <laughs>
<laughs> Let's shoot them down. Fine. Do I Do I want to know? Fine. Fine. No, don't attack them. Don't don't hit them. Don't attack them. Crap. ID complete. The Russian fighters. What the hell's going on? Stay sharp. Uh-huh. Right. I'm shooting him down. Any complaints? Granted. Granted. Yes. Welcome. Yeah, good work. Straight away, kill the bandit. Security scanning is under Great. You don't think it's a scorpion fish, do you? I managed to catch a glimpse of the three strikes. Okay, targets, get the targets, get the targets. Yeah, please. <laughs> please aim carefully this time. <laughs> Count, you better not be shooting someone. That's not targets. Yeah, they are in my way, yes. Get in my way. You mean they're drones? You gotta be kidding me. Liaison escort has a radar lock. They're targeting you guys. What the hell? We were just, we were just helping them. A Russian aircraft. This is AWACS Longcaster. Do not engage the liaison. Break off now. Can you hear me on this channel, OC craft? Those escort aircraft are drones. They are currently being operated autonomously. They are not being controlled by anyone. They are flying on their own volition. What? What? Yay! We'll go. I gotta watch out for the flights here. I almost got hit. Three, three special weapons left. Great, Great drones, more drones. <laughs> Great. Oh, you had flares, drone, huh? You had some flares. Crap. Okay. Time to go missile on missile fight here now. Five left. All right. Don't upload anything yet. It better not be. I'm being targeted. Down. Good. Three left. All right, we're good. That's not gonna hit. Air G. Let's go. Nice. I'm gonna get hit first. 
I'm getting hit by drones and other things. Let's go. Yeah, you didn't hit me. No way, drone. Not this time. All right, that should be done. Nice. Another story to tell my boy. Be glad you're part of this uh, squadron, then, with Strider 3. All hostiles have been eliminated. Nice. General's helicopter is flying safely outside Anchorhead Bay. All aircraft, RTB, mission complete. Whee! Nice. Yeah, it's trying to do hostiles. Question mark. Quotation marks. <laughs> General, the Ocean aircraft is here to pick us up. The approaching Ocean aircraft. Losing his army? The Elaborate. They stole our seal orders. The VIP should be a piece of cake. Were you sent by the General staff? No. What? No! Missile! Of course, the C1 attacked it. Not surprised. Great. All of these really unknowns? Dang it. There goes our gen there goes the general. He got to the helicopter, escorted him right, and then just got shot down by another another plane. In this case being that one. Lovely. Ooh, it restarted. In order to respond to the attack on the base, Cyclops has scrambled after being on standby. We'll head up too once our planes are ready. Oh, and Labarth is dead. Yeah, you didn't see that. Apparently, he was shot down by another Ocean aircraft after he left the area of operation. I mean, of course. It was chaos. Still. <laughs> of course. Anyway, the sealed order operation has come to a close. We have no idea about a plan for going forward. All we can do for now is watch our own backs. What's up with the commander? He's staying in his room. He's still alive. Since we can hear him cry. <laughs> Ouch. Eh, rank B. I'll take it. Next mission. The island we went to was supposed to have been secured by the ground forces. They hadn't gotten a handle on things by the time we got there. So now we were stuck in the middle of a half-assed campaign. <laughs> My job was to get the planes ready for combat, making repairs and handing them over to our troop of cons. Thing is, the enemy still had the hangars. The comms were still down, so none of us knew what the hell was going on. The last transmission I heard before everything went to shit was that some prisoners from an Ocean military penal unit rioted and managed to escape. They stole some jets, and now they were flying around, taking out their former allies left and right. So the rest of the like of the side squadron thing, creeping around, the, the ones from the four 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 airbase. Overhead, chipped away at morale. Since the radio was out, it was quiet. I liked it better that way. All I heard was the gunfire. Here we were, walking around carrying rifles. We were pilots, damn it. Friendly fire will probably kill us. You know things are desperate when the guards that used to lock us into solitary are now telling us it's better we all stick together. <laughs> I guess they think our odds of surviving this war are better that way. Two guards for three convicts? Three After convicts? For miles across the battlefield, we came across the wreckage of a plane. Passenger, not military. Wait, it went down? I knew that rose. It was an erosion liaison plane. The guards' dogs smelled something and took off. They led us to a cliff. And the bodies. Today, I lost everything. Oh, it's the when princess. Nazi attacked our capital. My father, a man who was never really suited to being a king. I was to be flown out of the war zone to safety, but the plane was shot down by rebels. The entire crew was killed in the crash. So 
soldiers appeared and one shot at me. My dog went after him and shot him to pieces. He was my best friend. <laughs> after all those speeches I gave about working together for peace, I thought everyone felt the same as I did. I'm sure the soldier who shot at me knew I was the princess of Arugia. He was Arugian too. More soldiers have come. Now there is no one left to protect me. I am so numb, I cannot move. I watch as one of their dogs approaches. It sniffs mournfully at my dead friend. I wonder if it grieves for him as much as I do. I can barely think. I feel weaker by the minute. I don't know who these soldiers are with, but I managed to take a sip of the water they gave me. How long have you been here? Somehow, I muster the courage to answer the woman's question. I tell her I've been there three days. Three days? The hell? They gather around me with grim looks on their faces. What would they do if they knew I was the Erosion Princess? Oh, I think we know, don't we? I could have sworn. Oh, no, maybe not them. They probably don't. After searching the cockpit, oh, they do. Plane, the they woman do. who spoke to me before came back to me. This is an air to ground tactical radio. It still works. I noticed she walked with a limp. She knelt down next to me and asked her companions to give me some food. And then, very softly, she said, Listen, I used to listen to your broadcasts through both blinds. EXPOSED! <laughs> Just what did you see?